Alrighty, we are going to work on free motion on this. Now, I have decided to start in the middle and work my way out. So if I don't have enough on this side, <coughs> then I can add to it and not have no problem. I don't see if you can see that. Yes, you could. Okay. Make sure. Okay. So what I'm going to do now is I'm just going to fold this side up and get my pins. And I'm going to put pins down it so that I can get to the middle easier. It'll make it a whole lot easier. Get to where I can get to it. that way if it if it don't work out then I can always have the opportunity to make it work out and I have a gray thread on top of my on with my thread I want gray so I have gray so I'm done with the iron today, so it is off, right? Yeah, I got it off. I just want to make sure. Okay, so let's take me a minute, and then I'll be back. Alrighty. I think I'm ready to start doing it. I had to go get the old man. So we're going to work. Pull my drawer open. Keep the top drawer cleaned out so I can put my quilt on it. Alrighty. <coughs> now like I was saying, I'm not going to worry about what it looks like. I'm just going to quilt it all over and just play with it and have fun. Now what the hell? <laughs> Let's try this again. Out of my way. if I can't get me something to make it go. I'm having trouble with it. Alright. Let's try this. Straighten out. I believe I need to put 
put um fresh your foot down. And this is all I want is just to play with it. Give it some Give it some something to hold on to. Nobody. Oh. I think Buddy wants to go out, Rick. What kind of damage we done? What looks like? <laughs> Having a hard time with it? Yeah. Yep, yep, yep. But it don't look that bad. No reckon it does. Okay, here we go on a joy ride <clears throat> to take a look at it. So, well, we got a lot of bubbles in it. I don't think it looks that bad, though. I mean, it's more like it's gathered. You know what I mean? It's supposed to be that way. It don't look that bad. At least to me, it don't. Got gathered right here, though. But it kind of looks like um, that's what I want. Like I'm a uh, um, comforter like way you know what I mean all right let's uh, work on the next side so what I'm going to do is I'm just going to leave this right here like that turn this around now, all these that have pins that I need to take out, I'm going to go ahead and take them out down the middle. Because I don't need them in there no more. So we got them out. Now, let's scoop that back. <coughs> Grab these out here, and I'm going to give this one a fold over and pin it down. I think that middle one's going to be the hardest one to 
do. we're ready for this one do the middle one or the next to the middle one let's try it out so far I think I've been working on this quilt for two days so that's not bad being right here where I'm at but although I didn't have to make the block <laughs> okay. I'm gonna start off with these so I can have some grip. And I'm pretty well much do it the same identical way. My stitch is too big. So let's see. Let's go down. Let's try that out. Oh, yeah. That does help. small dry to anyway let's see what else we got here let's take that down too but they are a whole lot smaller so if we can't get them smaller than that though
we are with number two. Huh? I think I laid it down in the kitchen. Yeah. That B, we're going to hear it. Yeah, this one here looks pretty good, too. But I do have to say some of my stitches are big. At the beginning of it. So here we go again. I want, I, I, I think that's what it, really what I want. Is to make it look like it has a comforter look to it. I mean, it does look good, but see here? My stitches are big. And I turned it down so maybe it'll work. I see there was one fold in here somewhere. Where is it at? Where is that fold? I'm looking for it. Y'all probably already done seen it. But I don't see it. Right here. Right there. That's the only one I, can, I remember doing. Is it or not? I think it looks pretty good. Alrighty, I'll be back and we'll work on another one. Alrighty, I think we are ready to work on the third one in this row. So, I sent the, uh, the amazing quilt out today. So, it is on its way. And Monday, I'm going to start sending out, uh, hopefully, this quilt and the other quilt that I've, we've done. So that we can um, start getting them going. I like it. I think it looks good like that. I'm really happy with it. This time I caught that one that uh, buckled real bad. And I was able to catch it and get it out of there. It looks good. Looks really good. Alright. So, now. I'm going to go ahead and finish it. Well, let me just go ahead and we'll play with this one. We'll just go ahead and do it all. it around and I forgot to get the pins out. Got to get the pins out. Let's get that back over here. Get the pins out. If I don't, I may end up getting them all together. Two. 
at it all the way around I like it I like it I'm 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 really happy with it here's the last one and, and if you notice the way I did this one right here I moved this up and went underneath it and left the lace so that it wouldn't interfere with the lace. Alright. I think now all we got to do is trim the sides and put a uh, border around it. Alright, I don't know if you can tell or not, but it's crooked. So, we're going to go for it anyway. I got to work on trying to fix that. Alright, so now all I'm doing is just trimming it around. So that uh, we'll have the trimming completely done all the way around. I think it worked out perfect. So, but okay, why? Well, I, I want to get that loose. Uh, let's put that there and that over there out of the way, so we can. Get to going around our quilt. I don't know if I have enough or not to go all the way around it. But we're going to find out. So I have two colors on it. We're going to find out if it's going to go all the way around or not. So, I would like to start at the very beginning with it, and I think I'm going to, I'm going to try it and see. 
And this time, I'm going to sew just one down. I, I don't know how well it's going to turn out. Let's see. Let's go down a little bit. We'll go down. I don't mind having a little bit of blue on that side. Because you don't really don't want to. Because you, you ain't got nowhere to actually put it at. You know what I mean? So... garbage can out of my way and we'll keep on going down and down and around until we can't no more now if you want your uh, binding to show you put it on the back if you don't want to show you put it on the front and that's what I'm doing on this one is putting it on front so that it does not show but it will have the same two collars on the back of it and I think it turned out really good on the back too so now we're just gonna continue on the road Hopefully it'll work. And if it don't, well, we'll just have to add more to it. I ain't done no measuring or nothing. I just say, hey, look, that looks like it'll work. And that's what I do. Okay. Well, get in there. <laughs> no, it's tying up in a knot down here on me. Let's see if I can't turn it around now. We're just about done with this quilt. And then we get started on another one. See what we can do to make it different. I hope, anyway. <laughs> we pull it out here and let me get some brain going and see what I think about it. See how we can do it. Hopefully, we can do it different. I don't know. We'll see. We'll see what we can do. Trying to get down here to the end. All right, let me bring you over here and I'll show you how I'm doing this. And then we'll put you back over there. Yeah, I'm gonna have to add some more. I'm almost just about out here. Okay, but this is the way I'm gonna do it. I'm gonna take this one. Well, what I did, okay, I lost my needles. All right, so to get yourself together here now. But yeah, I'm going to have to add some more to this. All right, now I'm folding this up to where it goes to the corner. And then I'm folding it right back down on itself. Like that. Going that up. There we go. See how that looks? Now I'll put a pin in it. All right. So... Seeing that I do need more, we are going to see how much this is. And it is a two and well, that's my half two and like three eighths, I think. Huh? Oh, we got the PayPal card in. Cool. I like that. All right. So, let's find us some material. Ooh. Right here we go. Right here is a sum. 
so I'm going to lay this down right here on my line find my thing doodler here oh crappy crap you talked to me and I forgot what I was doing I'm going to cut that the same size because that looks like a perfectly good size okay All right. now I'm going to wait to use that one I'm going to go ahead and sew this one down on it <laughs> I wonder if I can find some more blue it's not quite time yet it's calmed down Oh, he's wanting to go too. <laughs> oh, goodness. Alrighty. Let's see if I can find some more blue to add to that. Looks like I'm going to cut it off of this. Now, this right here, I know will give me a whole... Uh, enough to go around it. So, let's see what we can do here. I want to make sure I get the right amount. Alright, I'm just going to go with two inches. That'll work. Oh, what am I doing? I think I'm tired, and Rick is supposed to be going to work. And I got my brain... I'm taking him to work. Now I know there's enough there now. I didn't finish that quilt. And I'll probably have some left over. Alright. And I like the breakup in it. Yeah, so here should give me enough to finish it. Uh, you're getting text in here, Rick. All right. All right. Let me throw you back over here. And I'm going to go ahead and sew that around. And then after I get all that sewed around, then we'll be back. All righty. I want to show you. Mama Cat came in. Yeah. And look. I started with pins again. And I ended with clips. I remembered them again. Yay! I like these clips. Really, I do. But I forget them. I don't know why I do. But I'm doing better. Now, Mama Cat has come in. And she's like, No, you are done for now. So, I've got it ready to go. Watch it, you. I've got it ready to go and start sewing all the way around it. So, <clears throat> I guess when I get an opportunity, I'll do it. But I gotta wait on Mama Cat. Alrighty, I've done that and now I'm going around it. I clipped the corner off there. So now I'm going to do this corner. Let's see, I'm gonna flop it down this way first. This is turning out pretty. I, I love the way it's doing. It's all looking good as it can be. Oh. So there's that corner. And then I'm just going to go on around. And I'm going to continue. And clip down the rest of it. Sew down the rest of it. And whenever I get done, then we'll... Uh, take a picture of it probably have to wait till tomorrow because it's getting dark out there now it's raining and it's raining so we don't want to do that alrighty then so we will see you later alrighty I can't see what I'm mashing over there dogs laying in the floor so I have got it done so I'm ready for the um, turn it around for the signature patch and send it out the door <laughs>
So there's this one. And I think it looks gorgeous. I like it. I really do. I think it's pretty. I don't need it or I would keep it. It's so pretty. The way I feel about it, it's gorgeous. I think whoever gets it will like it. All right. I'm hoping that you can see me here. We're going to measure it. But from the floor to where you can see me right here, this is how big it is. All right. And let's get the measuring tape up here. And let's do some measuring to it. See how big it is. See what it looks like. <laughs> 48. I'm going to remeasure that so I can look at it better. Okay. Four, I'm going to put 40. And I'm going to wait. I'm going to wait. I'm going to remeasure it. Yeah, 48. I'm going to say 48. 48 By 57 and a half All righty so now we have that so now we want to scratch my eyeball because it's itching, it's itching. All right, let's see. If we're looking at it on the bed, and we had a little girl going that way, and the little boy should be right here going that way. I'm going to take this one. Turn it over here, and we're gonna start marking on it. Oh no! Let's see. I don't know if this will show up there or not. Hmm. I'm having a bad feeling it won't. Oh yeah, it's showing up right there. Okay, here we go. Let's see how we can do this. Right. So community quilt, where's that? There. First community quilt is what I'm putting on it. First. Community. And put uh, made by community of. Sandy Wilkins Brown. I've got to turn my iron on. Let's get this bad baby going. Um, then we have the tenth the 
night. <coughs> Twenty <coughs> eighteen. All righty, there it is. I think I wrote everything down. Yeah, got the date, how big it is, and the name of it. That's all I need on mine. All righty. Give this an iron down, so it'll hold. It's um, ink in there. This thing cuts off on its own. I like that. Rick came in here last night and said, we have a red light on. And I'm like, yeah, the red light uh, lets you know that it's off. And the green light lets you know that it's on, so that you can turn it off if it's on. So this has turned out really pretty. And I'm going to take it out there and hang it up on the um, outside on the porch now. Okay, here it is. Hanging up out here on my porch. Now I ain't going to try to turn this thing around to get the back either. Um, but I turned off the camera, and just as I turned off the camera, there was a gunshot out here. And me and Marie were talking. She didn't know where it come from, but I told her, I said, well, somebody's going to be on the news tonight. Because that was a gunshot. She's like, yeah, I know. <laughs> but there is the quilt. I don't know if you can see the back of it or not, but we'll walk around there to see. Gotta watch Bullet that he don't, um, oh, you see some of it, so we're gonna go on up the steps, okay? Here we go, up the steps. Whew. Whoa, I don't fall. Oh, that looks pretty cool. Yeah. Alrighty. So... We are done with this one, and we're going to get started on another one. This is how to donate to my PayPal. You come down here to Poor Man's Sewing, and you mash on Poor Man's Sewing. Then you go over here to About, you mash on About, and right here is to donate to Poor Man Sewing. Thank you, I appreciate everything that is donated. It will go to the sewing shed that we are working on, or anything that you want me to put it on there, just leave a note on there, and I will see what it says. And I really do appreciate you donating, and watching my channel. A lot of hugs and kisses to you.